This is the awesome salesman. Say hi. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> he's um, looking over the paperwork. So he has this very serious face on. Say hi, babe. What are we doing today? Getting, getting, getting your um, your X6 that you that you always wanted. Hey. Finally, y'all, it's so gorgeous. It's so gorgeous. It's my dream car, and I am getting it today. We're almost done. Should be another. It's gonna rain again. Looks like. We're trying to go see if you want to go look at slingshots because you want to get his slingshot. Are we gonna go look? Y'all, can't wait to show y'all my baby. It's white. Beautiful. All right, y'all. Here's my baby. Here is my, y'all, it is big bodied, okay? Oh, look how this just lights up. Look how, y'all, this car is Oh my goodness. Freaking gorgeous. Yes, y'all. So I got my vehicle. Now we are SUV family. Yes. Yes. Hey, hi. Hi, guys. So we are back yeah, at the yeah. house. It's currently like 9 30 at night. She just took a big old poop. I showed her our new car. We about to watch some UFC fights. Pop, pop. Then threw down. Then threw down in the kitchen. <laughs> Y'all, he made this best, like, gumbo shrimp steak, <laughs> surfing <laughs> turf, <laughs> rice, gravy, butter, po potato <laughs> sauce. I don't know. Boy, it was so damn good. Oh, it was delicious. <laughs> so we are just relaxing. Say hi. Say hi, fam, bam. Say hi. <laughs> Look at those eyes. <laughs> hi. Hi. <laughs> yes, guys. So we were just relaxing the rest of the evening. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. We got, I got to go. We got a nail appointment in the morning. So I will catch y'all tomorrow. Good night. Say good night. Okay. Good morning, my love. How are you today? I manifested you. I hope you're feeling well. You look lovely. Hey y'all, good morning. I know I look crazy as hell, but we're gonna, we gonna get cute in an hour or so. But what I'm doing right now is running to this pharmacy. I'm so used to like doing the side, now it's like down here. I can't even. <laughs> um, I'm going to this pharmacy. And then to reverse, you gotta go forward. And to drive, you gotta go back. It's, it's weird. But um, heading to the pharmacy right now to get my birth control. I supposed to start it this morning. Completely forgot to get it yesterday due to everything going on. But and I can see the mileage, like the speed that I'm going, and a reflection in the mi in this window. But I don't see where it's showing it on the dashboard. So I think there's something at the end or closer to the window that is reflecting where I can just see it on the window. It's so weird. I got so much to learn about this car, y'all. But I got my sunroof bag. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, does he feel good on my bag? Jesus. This should be pulling out heat, so why? I need to figure this out. And good morning, by the way. Happy Sunday. It's Sunday. And I typically would go to spin class, but today I'm just gonna lift weights later. Just because I have to go get birth control. We have a nail appointment in a few hours. I need to swap these wigs out. I got too much to do. I just can't make it today. But I will be lifting today. Later. Anyway, I'm going to get on here a little later. I'll talk to y'all in a bit. Alright y'all, 
So I just got my birth control. And, uh, I don't know what the end of it is. Alright, it says take one tablet by mouth every day. So it's 8.40. I'll just probably take it at like 8.45 every morning. That's what I'll do. Or 9 o'clock. Let's just hope that I don't have blood clots, heart attack, high blood pressure, or weight gain. Or pulmonary edema. So I ain't got time for that. They still sleep. I'm about to go sort these wigs out and get myself ready because we gotta go. Yeah, our appointment's at 11.30 and we already rescheduled our mail appointment three times. So I'll get on here later. I gotta get moving. Love y'all. Hey guys, so I am with my beautiful mother. Say hi. Everyone loves you. <laughs> so we are almost at the nail salon. We are getting manis and petties again. I think I'm going to get white on my nails this time. Mom said she think I should do white or she think I should do what was it powder blue? Like a baby powder blue? Like like a matte or like a shiny powder from a shiny blue. Oh um, okay. Oh mom, that's the brewery I went to with the nursing students. So yeah. It's nice. Yeah, y'all. Yeah, so it's a really, really nice day. Um Arain really wants to go look at slingshots, so we may go and look at slingshots today depending on, you know, when we get back or whatever. So, and I'm working out today because I didn't work out for two days. And you're cooking dinner. And I'm cooking dinner. Yeah. So, there's a lot going on. But, today is a great day. So, I just want to get on here and say hey. And I will talk to y'all later and I'll show y'all my nails once I'm done. Okay. Alright y'all, so we just got here. I'm just in some jeans from Fashion Nova, like bell bottom type jeans. V-neck from Zara, of course. Um, my Tory slides. <laughs> Not much, but I don't know what color to get y'all. Yeah, We just got our toes done. We got the, we're doing the same color on our nails. It's Funny Bunny is what it's called. Y'all yeah, see, so freaking cute. They're about to do my nails now. I'm gonna cut them down really low. It starts going <laughs> So I can get to being stressed out. Are you having a good time Absolutely. <laughs> yeah, I'm so worried. Can you not be in pamper? Right. All right, I'll get on here a little bit. Okay guys, so I'm done. I'm just waiting for my mom to finish her final coat, but I went with Funny Bunny. I had to get five coats, four coats on my top nail. Cause ever since I, my second trimester, my third trimester, my nail bed on a couple of my fingers have darkened and I don't know why. It's only like in the inner corner. It looks like a shit stain. I don't know what's going on. If you know what's going on, help me out. Comment down below, tell me what to do. <laughs> anyway, um, and I got the same thing on my toes. But it's a really, really nice day. I'm just waiting for her to get done and then I'm gonna head home, see what Arane wants to do. But yeah, I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Peace. I just got home. Think it too long? She is tearing up this teether. Ring. Say hi. Say hi, guys. Say good afternoon. <laughs> Mom, that hair looks so good on you. Huh? Say hi. Tell them that you tea then. Tell them. Yeah, Tell them. Yeah, they're Chinese, right? 
Chinese. So. All right, don't forget we were going to the gym today. You feel like a lazy day. I'll work out in the garage if you don't want to. He's saying they're going to be closed. Are they closed? On Sundays or just closed early? Close, uh, close by. Oh. It's work right now. That took a long time. I know, it got to like 1230. Hey y'all, so it's been about an hour or so. I'm about to, I was going to do a garage workout. I'm not driving to the gym today, but I'm just going to go ahead and work out in my front neighborhood gym so I can just hit weights real quick because I didn't work out in two days the last two days but I've been super busy and I really haven't been eating in two days so I still am losing weight which is not good but good but whatever um I don't know if I told y'all y'all I've been putting this on because y'all know I like my you know upscale perfumes or whatever but this mix bar <sighs> y'all better get on mix bar and they're at Target okay I had to snatch this up all the perfumes were gone okay the body sprays were mostly gone. I snagged coconut palm and there was a wood, mahogany, teak wood one. I don't know what it is, but y'all, these smell so good. This is a hair and body mist. So I more so wear this for like errands, daily errands, going to the gym, you know, spreading my hair, spreading my clothes. Just to smell nice, but not doing too much and not using my expensive shit. You know what I'm saying? But this, y'all, if you haven't already, go to Target. And check out Mix Bar, cause honey, honey, these are crack, crack. Anyway, let me get to this gym. I'll be back. Okay, so before I go in the gym, let me go ahead and give you guys a car tour, since a lot of you have been asking, cause y'all seen my ID before this is posted. So let me just do a little quick, you know, tour of the car. Okay, guys. So this is the front. This is the 2018. X6 BMW and it's like in a pearl white it's absolutely gorgeous this is a really really big body and again this is the X6 I have the black interior okay this is what the inside looks like and I'm used to having this up there so it's really really weird but I'm getting adjusted to it I absolutely love it this is very, very high tech. Um, I have Apple Play, Apple Car, or something like that attached to it, so it's connected to my phone. As you can see, there's still a picture of behind um, when I actually park, but it just has so many features I'm still learning. Of course, it's push start, um, all of these features here. We have a heat cooling, a heating part of it. Each side and the front and back of the car you can control so this side can be hot this side can be cold this side can be hot this side can be cold because it's controlled back here which i'll show you guys in a minute um one feature i really do love about this car is let me show you y'all y'all gotta help me name her i'm about to call her karen y'all think it's a game so this here actually shows where you can actually set how you want um, this I have to raise extremely high because this drops, but it doesn't drop low like my other car. So I really have to be way higher in order to deal with this here, but it's really beautiful. It has lane departure assist, blind spot assist. Um, so if the wheel will vibrate, if it feels that you're falling asleep, or if you're swerving, it actually has a picture of your car when you actually get into it. It'll let you know if you're getting too close to a car, this will beep and sound the hell off if you're too close to anything if you're gonna hit something this is what the interior looks like of course you pull this back and we have some um cup slots here um has a cd player in here i don't think i'll actually use it bmw if y'all don't know like they're classic cars but they don't have a lot of the they have upgrades like this is very savvy and upgrade but they're very basic in a sense of like just classic like they don't have too many crazy gadgets or whatever but i really really love this look so 
one thing I like too, you guys aren't gonna be able to see it, but there's a holographic reflection. If you kind of see what that's beeping at right now, at night, you can see it even better. So when you're driving, there's something down there that reflects, it's like a holographic reflector and it shows you what your um, speed is right now. So if I'm doing 60, 70, you can see it clear as day and it's nowhere on here. It literally is on the window. It's like a holographic thing. So you can like look at that. Like it's so freaking dope. As I learned the features, there's so many features to this car that I have to learn and I have no idea how to get back to. Um, and it's touchscreen, which is pretty dope. So if I wanna do GPS, I can do that here. Got my iTunes, my music, got some Foxy Brown. Got my phone call. Like I can call, I can text. It reads out a text um, to me when Oran wrote me. It literally started talking. Said Oran says, "I love you." Blah 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 blah. Pretty dope. It comes with this dope behind sunroof, which all my cars except for one had sunroofs, and well, except for two, my last Mercedes did not. So I'm so happy that I have a sunroof now. Okay, and I have the black interior. This is more like a wooden, dark wooden panel freaking love this okay so it actually sit in it lifts when you get out and then when you get in and you shut the door it'll adjust back down to the year setting which i'm number one i'm pretty sure ray will set his to number two so when he gets in the car he can just press two and this will adjust the seat will adjust according to his body type and his height and so forth so that's pretty dope of course y'all know all the features here um ac um heated cooling um like you can control everything here it's pretty dope this has extra features here apparently you can hit off and it takes like i don't know it's like a traction something that it does to the tires which will allow you to haul ass in this car and y'all these x6s are one of the fastest freaking cars i just learned <laughs> like they're fast so you can put it in sport you can race it you can put if you push off it's going to do something to the wheels where you can actually do donuts and swerve and do all this crazy shit why this is on here i don't know i'm not going to do that shit i'm going to be in comfort most of the time will i be in sport no a rain might be in sport i'm not doing that um this looks like a camera vi i don't know what these are the manual is inside here i have to learn what all of this means this is i think this is emergency brake two auto I, I have to learn this shit okay there's so much to learn um so yeah i absolutely am in love this is my dream freaking car let me show you the back okay a lot of space for london in her car seat and baby number two you know once he or she decides to come and as you can see it also has control settings back here as well so you can control the left side here on off the right side you can do heat cold you can do whatever you want back here which i freaking love it's a lot of space y'all a lot of freaking space and i love that this car isn't like white white it's like that pearly white i'll put in the description or somewhere on the screen what it actually the name of this color is it has a number here for bmw roadside assistance it has a lot of space so i have my gym bag here this is my work nursing bag when i go to work and this is my lab bag for clinical not for clinical for labs on campus for nursing school so these are the three bags that are pretty much back here um you can press this to lock it this to shut it as well Oops. okay so that's closed and y'all this body is just like freaking amazing i freaking love it so much s drive 335i and you can do the same thing on this side y'all so this is my new baby i'm completely in love if you guys have any questions regarding this car anything you want to know about this car um i'll find out for you if you're interested in getting it but y'all this is my freaking baby okay it's freaking gorgeous so this is her this is she and also has this type of color chrome it's almost like a bronzy type of it's not silver it's not gold it's like a bronze metallic accents here which i think is pretty dope also the car is on right now but these it lights up on the inside at night as well like along the inside of the interior like this will be like blue 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 all inside and then they have like little lights you'll see at night that will shine from the bottom you lock the car like this no you unlock the car like this as long as you have the keys in your purse or close to you you can unlock it here and then to lock it you press this which i can't do right now because the car's on 
but it's pretty dope y'all this is my new baby this is the car i'm gonna have for a very long time that i plan on having paying off and maybe give it to my daughter keep it in the family but i freaking love it so yeah i have to learn so much and it'll pop up and tell you it just tells you so much i just have to learn how to work this <laughs> but yeah but yeah y'all so i hope you enjoyed my little car tour again this isn't me bragging this isn't me doing whatever y'all see how hard i work i work for everything that i got no one gives me anything no one i pay for this okay like i work hard i've always been the type of person to work hard and i love when people tell me when i can't have something because now, now i gotta go get it now, now i just gotta go get it you know what i'm saying so work hard grind hard y'all can have whatever y'all want that's why i love my channel is because you see a lot of families you know doing well but honestly you don't see a lot of black families a lot of black healthy couples and relationships and families growing grinding and we want to be inspired you know what i'm saying so when y'all see this i want y'all to see this as an inspiration if she can do it i can do it not oh misha this misha that blah 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 i am just working my ass off okay i work hard you work hard you can have whatever you want as well so again this is to encourage you guys and this is to you know show that i got my dream car i manifested this i've been meditating on it for a very very long time i know this is the car i wanted i'm just like i'm gonna get it i visualize myself um that's how i manifested this car i visualize myself in it every day white this is the exact car that i wanted i visualize how i felt riding in it the music i'll play in it the ice coffees i'll go get from a coffee shop in it the gym i'll go to in it how i'll drive up and how my baby will be in the back seat spilling fruit loops all over the place you know what i'm saying down to the detail like that's how i attract everything good into my life even from a rain from my family everything that's in my life now i drew that because i put in the work and i attract that and i act as if i already have it so when it's time to actually go get it I have a spirit of expectancy. Like I've always been like that since I was one years old. My mom will tell you I'll be one in the grocery store going up to some white man, a white lady, some random person be like, can I have a dollar? And they're like, oh no, I can't have a dollar. I'm like, huh? What do you mean no? What do you mean I can't have, what do you mean no? Like I just don't, my mom always said that about me. I always wanted more. I expected more for myself. I wanted to live a certain type of way. I wanted to have certain things. I've always been like that since I was younger. So I will grind and grind and grind until i get what i want and that's it y'all so not to go on this whole tangent oh i'm out of breath i just ate my pop-ups surf and turf steak shrimp gumbo oh my god it was so good so i gotta get in here and do this really intense hard but quick workout and i will catch y'all later i hope you guys enjoy this um i hope you guys love the car i freaking love the car comment down below what your dream car is and let's have a little chit chat and Yes, I will talk to you guys later. Okay. Oh, yes, I have a little gym to myself. Just how I like it. All right, y'all. Let me get this workout in and I will catch y'all a little later. Bye. Hey, y'all. Good morning. It's Monday morning and it's nice and cold out here. It's a beautiful day. Oh, it's like 8.22 a.m maternal child in OB lecture starts at 8 30 and like seven more minutes so I'm just taking a moment to meditate and talk to God and tell him to give me strength to get through this next semester <laughs> having my coffee just trying to take in the sun to improve my mood I'm already having a good day but to improve my mood like y'all Ooh, it's cold out here. It feels so freaking good. Just focusing on how blessed I am and how uh, everything's gonna be good. Y'all, there was 28 people in the class. Ask me how many people in the class right now. Just ask me. I'll wait. 17. 17 people are left in the class from 28 from the first semester. They're cut through. They ain't playing. They ain't playing. So, yeah. I hope you guys have a wonderful, productive morning. I don't know if this is the start of a new vlog. If it is, happy Monday. Welcome to another vlog. Welcome to the fam. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe down below. Turn on the notification bell so you know when I post another video. I love you guys so much. Again, 
and this hair is V show hair again I lightened it last night see I just wanted to see that sun-kissed brown which looks so nice in the sun so cute anyway yeah y'all I'm more like this I'm more like this today which one should I do no matter I'm in the house I ain't going no damn well except to the gym later anyway I love you guys so much and I hope you have a wonderful wonderful productive morning make sure y'all grind don't stop I'm not stopping y'all better not stop and I will talk to you guys in a little bit bye PMS was syndrome or PMS um, the curse, as some people would call it, um, cluster of physical, psychological, and behavioral symptoms. It's very poorly understood. 30 to 80% of women. Hey y'all, so I am currently on my hour lunch break from class. So I think this is the perfect time to start working on my closet, which y'all can see is a damn mess. I'm getting rid of so much stuff to the point where it almost looks empty. That's how much I want to start over, which is going to be so hard because I'm kind of a hoarder. And I'm like, what if I need that later for an outfit and I don't have it anymore? But there's a lot of stuff in this closet I have not worn. His side is way better than mine, but it's just a lot of shit in here that I need to clear out and declutter. So I'm not going to be able to finish it with y'all um the whole time because i gotta get back on in like 45 minutes but i'm gonna work on it and do what i can because yeah this is crazy but before i let y'all watch me throw stuff away oh i'm not gonna throw stuff away i'm gonna put it on my poshmark which i'll put it somewhere on the screen it's misha's closet so go to poshmark and follow misha's closet a lot of you have been asking for me to instead of you know giving it away or donating it um put it on poshmark because they like my style, blah, blah, blah. So I appreciate that. Um, so the pieces that are really good quality or, you know, nothing wrong with them. I'll definitely post it on my Poshmark if you guys are interested in buying them. Let me know. Um, that pink dress that I wore to my baby shower, um, I'm putting that on Poshmark too. So there's a lot of stuff I'm just getting rid of. Okay. So anyway, let me work on this for a little bit. I should make a second coffee. I may go make a second coffee really quick and then put all this stuff up because it's just a lot of stuff. I just got to get it's, 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 it's driving me crazy. But anyway, all right, let me go ahead and work on this closet. Y'all can watch me do that. Okay. Okay. I got my coffee. All right, let me see. You know, maybe I should do this another day. This gives me like Claire Huxtable vibes and I can't get rid of her. Now this would look cute with a regular t-shirt. Oh god, I can't get rid of this. Yeah, this looks cute with a regular t-shirt, some boyfriend jeans, some loafer. Like, I need some new ones because these are wore out, honey. But like with some loafers like these, these are from Michael Kors. This is cute. Oh. Yeah, I, I can't. I can't get rid of this. All right, now that's not bad. A lot of these things I find from Goodwills, guys, like the men's section and blazers and stuff, honey. Honey. Of oversized stuff, y'all. Just think of like a, I'm kind of a retro dress back in the day type of 
because it's a little outfit. But you wear, <laughs> I like oversized boy button down shirts. And you can make it sexier by having something more va va boom and curvaceous. But what y'all think? This is a Ralph Lauren um, men's button down that I usually throw over with some tights and like a little white t shirt underneath just to make it more like Demi Moore and Ghost. Back, back sorry, I was answering some correspondence. Damn, starting again. I can listen to her from here though. I'm expecting one more person we can't come in. Which I think? I keep this or not? Okay, guys, so it's a few hours later. Let me show you all the stuff that, well, let me show you what I'm looking at right now. So I got rid of a lot of stuff and it still looks packed. Okay, so sporty stuff, my scrubs on this side, athletic, you know, jackets, um, sweaters, more sporty things, two piece suits, sweats, and then my slacks and tights. And then it goes into my trousers and then all my jeans. And then my tops, blouses, which I got rid of so much stuff, but it still looks like a lot. Um, my jeans and then my tops, my basics. These are the only two patterns. With this, this, and this are the only two patterns I have hung here. And then my corduroy um, tops, my jackets, and then all of my blazers. And then it goes into my leather jackets, my jean jackets, and then my coats. So this is what it's looking like yeah so this is what it's looking like and then i cleared i got rid of so much stuff so all this stuff here looks a mess right now but i'm putting all of this on poshmark there are a lot of shoes i haven't even worn like those those i wore these a few times got them in two different colors so the stuff that's not you know good or quality i'm definitely gonna um donate those but a lot of stuff here I need to organize. I'm just going to put them in bags right now. Because I have to take pictures of them and then post them. So make sure you guys check out my Poshmark. But this is what we're looking like right now. Okay, so it's it still feels cluttered to me. But it's way better than it was. So, yeah guys. This is what we have. Hey y'all, so... We're just leaving the mall. Come say hi, babe. You haven't been in the vlog. Hey. <laughs> so we just went into the mall real quick to grab some shoes for my friend's birthday dinner and her birthday gift. Um, get her a nice perfume. Now we're just gonna go grab some Chipotle real quick and then head back to the house. I gotta work the next two days. Damn. Yeah. So I'm glad I at least got my closet done. I didn't get to get a workout in, but at least me walking this mall for 45 minutes, at least I got my steps in a little bit, a little bit of cardio. But we'll see. All right, I'll get on here a little later, y'all. She's been very fussy. I'm rocking her in her chair. I had to play white noise. But it works like a charm. We're gonna take her to the doctor in the morning. She's gonna see her pediatrician to see why she's breaking out. And she's really fussy, she's teething. And like, crying bloody murder. So I just got her to calm down. All right, y'all, I'm going to lay her down and try to get some sleep. I have to be to work at 7 a.m. So 
I'll let you guys know how her appointment goes tomorrow. All right, good night. Dab, kiss, kiss. I'm gonna talk to butt. Come on, chunk, chunk. Come on, chunk, chunk. Come on, chunk, chunk. You just give me so much kisses. Now you don't want to give me no kiss. <laughs> I can't believe you're only 10 weeks. You look like a freaking toddler. <laughs> Rain. Mm -hmm. What you doing? Oh, I'm sleepy. I'm sleepy. Can you get her so I can go to sleep? Yes, <laughs> <laughs> I gotta work. I get up at 5.30. It's already 11. And this girl is wide awake. Chunk, chunk. Chunk, chunk. Hey. Can, can you go to sleep? Can you, can you please? Can you try to go to sleep? <laughs> You're not going to try to go to sleep? so tired. Yum, yum. Come on, let's go sleep. People, you always be whacking somebody. Huh? <laughs> Monday. Say hi. Say hi to your virtual aunties and uncles. They say you be making their day. Yeah, give me a kiss. Here. Girl, what is you doing? What is all the squirming about? Huh? Yeah. What is it? What is it? What? <laughs> you trying to lick the camera? <laughs> Can you go to sleep? It's time to go night night. Okay. Uh, it's time to go night night, okay? Come on, come on. Uh, come on. Uh, 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 uh. What is all of this? Your chocolate stuff. What? what? Okay, let's go night night. Okay, okay, uh, okay, y'all. I talked to y'all later. She doing too much. <laughs>
Okay. 